Good morning, everyone. We're going to do a little, just a short garden walk. These are my little friends, the turkeys. Aren't they pretty? They're unique animals, that's for sure. Very unique. I like them. And some of them even like me. <laughs> Here's one. I think this one likes me. Is it this one? No, it's... Which one is it? Which one of you guys likes me? I think it's this one. There we go. Yeah, see? Hi. You're so beautiful. You're a nice bird. Hi. You're a nice bird, too. Yeah. Oh, so pretty. Hello. Would you like me to pat your head? There we go. Oh, you're nice. All right, kids. Okay, well, there's not much in bloom right now. We have buckwheat growing everywhere for the bees to have late fall flowers to munch on. And right over here where the turkeys were, we have some buckwheat planted. It's not up yet, really. You can't really... Oh, well, a couple little seedlings are up. You can't really see, though. As they grow, we'll film more. There's really not much there to see. Our yard is filled with turkey feathers. The ducks all laugh in the background. They think everything's funny. More turkey feathers. <laughs> there's some buckwheat. I've got buckwheat growing in a, the... Uh, there's a little raised bed over there. That's all buckwheat. And... This little topsy-turvy tomato thing actually produced tomatoes this year. There's a couple of them right there that are still green, but I have picked several off that have turned ripe, that have ripened. So we got that going on. Uh, make sure the gate's shut so the turkeys don't escape. And we'll just take a little walk. Everything is changing for fall. Yes, it's hot in daylight. <laughs> Here we go. We've got a lot of goldenrod in bloom. This will be another thing that the bees will like. It's really a very pretty yellow. An underrated plant, I think. And I think I'm going to take a little walk. There's the blinking mobile. We'll leave her her privacy. And for right now, we'll come around and... There's some asters. These are just wild asters. Nothing special, but pretty nonetheless. And more goldenrod. Ooh, birds. Lots of goldenrod. Look at that. Look at that yellow. It really is quite beautiful. And, uh, bachelor's buttons. Look at that. Just growing next to the road here. We've got bachelor's buttons. I probably do this walk a couple of times today. <coughs> oh, look at this. Look at that goldenrod spread out. That's kind of an interesting shape. Really likes that afternoon sun, I guess. I can hear the turkeys. And then, of course, there's a ton of clover still blooming alongside the road. But, as you can see, things are already starting to look like fall, which I'm not ready for quite yet. Seems like summer just began and it's over already. What I really want to check out, we probably have some wind noise going on. It's a little breezy here. Which actually makes it a little cooler, because without this breeze, it would be very hot. I want to check out the autumn clematis around the side of the house and see how the um, Rosa Sharon is doing. 
see if there are any more blossoms on it or whether it's finished for the season. Well, I see goldenrod, bachelor's buttons, and some other things. Aha! There it is. You can see it right there. There's a couple of its buds. They look like they're pretty spent. So, not much going on there. There are a few of them kind of hidden in the weeds here. I hope they make it through the county's chopping. They always try to do a little too much. Oh, look at that. The autumn clematis is almost over. I can't believe it. It's a short-lived plant. So beautiful, though. Look at that. It's just everywhere. It's climbing everywhere. I'm going to have to cut it back this coming spring and get rid of some of it. The seed heads on the ornamental grass are very pretty this time of year. And, of course, we have the uh, climb up in here. Here we go. Look at that. There is the, uh, what do you call it? Oh, good lord. I'm having a brain aneurysm right now. Um, hydrangea, thank you. So the hydrangea is in good shape. As you can see. It's actually quite a large one. You can see the pink. Whoa, that sun in my eyes is a little much. There we go. Look at that. It's really cool how it turns from green to pink. I like that very much. Here's another one here, too. We have a another one. This one, the flowers, the individual flowers are a little bigger. And they do the same thing, but these seem to turn more, stay more green, and not go right to pink. Look at those bracts. Those are some big ones right there. It's an interesting plant, that's for sure. Man, I got blinded by that ray of sun. Wow. Okay. Get out of the weeds and keep walking and see what else there is to see. It looks like the white jella has finally finished. It has decided the season is over. Looks like we have some ornamental grass trying to start right here. And there's a pretty little yellow flower next to it. go just just a little I don't know what it is just some little weed <laughs> and then of course poison ivy look at that it's everywhere out here this right here there's some with the bloom with flowers on it actually if you can see right there this is mint it's like spearmint my guess is it escaped my garden. It's a very invasive plant, so it has come this far, all the way down over here. Probably, I don't know, acres and acres that the seeds jumped with the help of birds and other pollinators, I'm sure. Oh, look at this. You guys, I don't know if you guys can see it. I don't know if it shows up very well, but there's like a little kitty or bunny trail going right up into the weeds there. A lot of pretty yellow flowers. The same kind, kind of like a, it's almost like a, like a black-eyed Susan, but there's more than one on each, you know, on each plant. Man, what county in there, freaking poison. Drives me nuts, man. Nobody asked them, you know? 
Don't need it, don't want it. And then of course their planes fly over. We have crop dusters around here and they just indiscriminately fly over and, you know, make a big mess. Alright, we're going to walk through a bunch of mint and check out some pretty flowers here. Or, actually they used to be pretty flowers. They're kind of fading and then we have asters behind them. Very pretty. There are a lot of deer trails going up and back through here. I think actually last night Road caught some really good footage of deer as they were crossing through the property toward the, the lick. There's a lick out there that they apparently get a lot of good minerals and salt from. Oh man, I'm glad I brought a what do you call it with a bandana because I am sweating. Look at that. Look at all the goldenrod. There's a ton of it. And somebody just threw an empty box out here. Look at that. I have no idea what's in it. Freaking cat litter. Really? Huh. Nice. Well, now i got to carry this back and dispose of it. Are you kidding me? Man, people, I swear. And over here, look at this. Look at this. Sure. Fucking assholes. People are such assholes. Why would you want to mess up? Beautiful, beautiful countryside, throwing your garbage everywhere. All right, here we go. There's a cute little yellow flower just starting to open. And there are some beautiful cone flowers. Look at that. Let's see if we can get a little closer. There we go. That's a big one right there. Nice big seed head. Okay. And let's walk. Oh, look, it's a hickory tree. Check it out. That's the hickory tree right there. And it's dropping nuts everywhere. You can see them on the ground here. There's a couple exposed that are open. Oh, shit, there's another another can. Look at that. Michelob. Nice. Fucking idiot. Well, you know, it's more aluminum for us to turn in, I suppose, and get cash for. I don't know why anyone would want to just dump it. <sighs> Whatever. Free money. Oh, look. A little baby plant. This is Teasel. Check it out. Look at how fuzzy the little flowers are. There's kind of an adult flower right there at the top, top. That's kind of interesting. That will get cut down by the county's mower, I'm pretty sure. Oh, look at this. I don't know what kind of plant this is. It's got red berries on it and the leaves are turning red. A little purpley red. Isn't that pretty? Very nice. There's another one. Look at that. Isn't that interesting? Very cool. Okay. Well, I guess we'll just keep looking for garbage to pick up. And in the meantime... Oh, there's a giant acorn. Look at that. That's a pretty good size one. Throw that in the bushes. Maybe it'll sprout. You never know. Right? Oh boy, am I sweating. Whew. Oh, sweat's just rolling off me. There's another can. Unbelievable. Now, let's just wing them out the car, because, you know. People are animals. They just really are. They have no business. 
in the world if they can't abide by a few simple, simple courtesies. Like, throw your garbage away. If you're going to drink and drive, well, don't do that. You know? Go find a spot where you can all hang and dispose of your crap there. Don't just throw it on the side of the road. Here's another. A freaking bottle. Look at this. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Well, I don't want to take up everyone's time bitching about garbage, but check this out. Look at that. Look at the seed heads on those. I think this is what they call Joe Pieweed. I'm not entirely sure. But these were like kind of pink earlier in the in the year. And now they're fuzzy with seeds. See? Very interesting. And then of course lots more beautiful blue bluish purple, I should say. Uh, fall asters. It's just a we call it a weed around here basically, but they are very pretty. There's a limb that fell recently. Oh man. I'm really sweating. Whew. But at night when we hear the cars out here, we know what they're doing. Drinking and throwing their trash in the ditches. Look at that. There's a little bunny trail going up into the woods. And the poison ivy leaves are starting to turn color. There's some trash down there. Do I dare? I don't know. Maybe I should go pick it up. Let's see if I can. It's a piece of plastic. It's a piece of plastic. Oh yeah, it's a piece of plastic. Okay. Yeah, I just hate for there to be trash everywhere. Oh, there's another beer can. This is just just awful. Oh no, it's more plastic. I don't really know what it is, but whatever it is, it doesn't belong in the ditch. Let's see if we can get it out of here. Damn it, there goes my, what do you call it? My bandana. Okay, I need to wipe my face. Okay. There we go. Pick up our little box of trash and be done with it. <coughs> well, this way. <coughs> Excuse me. At least I feel like I'm helping a little bit. Okay. The soybeans are in the corn. All turning yellow. Let's make sure there's nothing else here to pick up. Nope, everything else looks pretty good. We'll go to our own side of the road here. Oh, I didn't see any trash on our side, but the drinkers around here are not so discerning about where they throw their crap. So, oh, look at that. There's a party. a little weed, but as you can see, since it's been cut back by uh, the county, it looks like it wants to grow and rebloom. So that would be nice. Some bachelor buttons in the weeds over there, or in the ditch. Here's some. There's one right there. Look at that. It's a pretty blue. Very common flower. Doesn't look like anyone threw anything on the this side of the road. This is a a hickory tree too. You can see by the bark. And yep, there's hickory hickory nuts on the ground. <sighs> With the breeze, it's actually a beautiful day. I'm sweating, but you know. That's because I'm walking. And 
that's about all that's going on today. I can hear the turkeys popping and clicking over there, making some young turkey noises. They make strange noises sometimes. Oh look, we could get fresh eggs. <laughs> if we want them. Anything down this way? We'll drop that off and step this way a little bit. Oh, here's some interesting little blue flowers. I'm not sure what you call these little things. I never got a name on them, but they're everywhere. Oh, here's some that we can probably get a better view of. See? There we go. Here's some right here. Not really sure what those are. They're very pretty though. It's a lot shadier down this way. Oh, here comes a big breeze. Now I'm going to be cold. <laughs> I think we're going to end it for right now and maybe we'll pick it up later on we'll have to see what's going on from here so everyone have a lovely morning and a nice afternoon and we will talk at you later okay bye bye peace